Hey, hey, damn it, no free rides. What is it? No free rides, it's a piece of bark. There we go. Too. It's Tuesday, Christmas Eve. Got to hurry up and get to camp and get to sleep before Santa Claus shows up. Um, you yeah, had an interesting night last night in that shelter. Uh, we probably crashed at about six o'clock in the evening. It was dark out already this time of year. And I woke up at about an hour later, two hours later, and that family of three were in the second story above us cooking up bacon. <laughs> frying it up right up above us and I'm thinking oh god we're gonna have every animal that's awake in the woods in our shelter tonight but it didn't happen but yeah they were frying up bacon in the shelter up on the second floor we got about 12 miles today 12 and a half miles into Gooch Mountain shelter it's gonna be a beautiful day it's already nice out it's uh about 7 40 20 to 8 and it's starting to warm up uh, it's not raining out, which is very nice. Our next stop is Hawk Mountain Shelter. In about four miles, we're going to stop there and grab some breakfast. We don't like eating too early in the morning. So we'll see you there when we get to the shelter. See you on up the trail. Came up over Hawk Mountain. Um, that was a heck of a climb. To start off the morning with. I think it's our biggest climb of the day. We got two more climbs, but nothing like what that was. I think we're about 3,800 feet right now. Uh, we're heading up here to Hawk Mountain Shelter. I think it's about a quarter mile. I'm gonna grab some oatmeal, some breakfast. Just take a little break, about a half hour, 45 minutes, and then head on out. And then we should have about another seven and a half miles to Gooch Mountain Shelter where we're staying at tonight. So we'll see you guys up at the shelter. All right, so we 
we got here? It looks like the shelter's quite a ways off the uh, trail, and it's downhill. We don't want to climb down on the shelter and then climb all the way back up to the trail. So we found a clearing here, and uh, you can see that mountain behind me. Pretty strange feeling we're going to be climbing that after lunch here. So we can get some food out here and get our bellies full and then get back on the trail pretty quick. See you on down here. All right, back on trail now. And that's where we were for breakfast when he came down and then up. And now we're going back up here. Check out this stealth sight. <laughs> what a great place to stay. Have sunrise in the morning, or you can have sunset in the evening. And you got this view. Phenomenal. Well, it's 12.30, we got five miles left to go. One mile is going up this mountain. Um, and then everything's downhill from there. We got a little bit of an incline afterwards, but mainly all downhill, and then some incline back up to the shelter. So we got some sugar into us, some energy. I <laughs> uh, talked to my parents, uh, got watered up, and then uh, I'm gonna head up this hill, get this thing done and over with. It's a beautiful day out. Gorgeous. It's not a cloud in the sky. It's gorgeous out here. It's awesome. Fantastic. All right, guys, we'll see you up at the top of this mountain. <laughs> halfway we're sitting at 3061 feet we need to get to 3400 just shot 3400 feet so about 300 320 more it's feet it's been steep yeah it's Every been steep step. yeah it's not the longest climb of the day but it is the steepest climb of the day we saw two more after this today yeah, two smaller ones, nowhere near like this, so. All right, we can get up this mountain here. We'll talk to you up on, on the trail. the 
top. So that's what 3,400 feet looks like. One mile straight up and it took 55 minutes. Yeah, 55 minutes. Basically the equivalent of, <coughs> well, yeah, if you climbed 100 flights of stairs from the first floor to second floor. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm gonna go pass out. How about you? We have two more mountains, honey. Yeah. Two right. more. I'll Not see you guys on yet. down the trail. <sighs> All right, almost to the bottom of this mountain, coming up to Cooper Gap here. I see a car parked at the, the parking lot, but unfortunately, we get to climb that mountain now. So I think it's our last major climb of the day. Hopefully, it's not as big as this one we just did, but we're gonna have to get it up. It nonetheless. We'll see you guys up at the top. Good evening, everybody. Um, it is day two. It is Christmas Eve, December 24th. Uh, about quarter to six right now. Sunset's already happened. You can see in the back there, that's west. Um, it's going to get dark here in about 15, 20 minutes. We've eaten, got everything all set up. It looks like we're going to be the only ones here tonight unless somebody's doing some night hiking and showing up. Tracy's got our ornament up on our Christmas tree for tonight. Hopefully Santa Claus does come and leave something underneath the tree for us. Uh, today was a 12.9 mile long day, which gives us 24.5 miles total over two days. Tomorrow is a 12 mile day. Um, I think 3,100 feet of eleva elevation gain tomorrow. We've got two major climbs. Uh, the last one is getting us up to the shelter on Blood Mountain. That's going to be a major climb. Uh, Blood Mountains, I think, is about 4,400 feet. We're going up to about 200 feet, 300 feet underneath that uh, for the night. So we're all wrapped up. We're going to get in our sleeping bags. It's supposed to be pretty decent out tonight, maybe 45 degrees. And uh, get some sleep and get back on the trail in the morning. You guys have a wonderful evening.